everyone welcome to my channel today I'm going to be showing you the Azaria Petite and I have it here in the black with gold hardware and I just have my little hand sanitizer on the side here and it is a convertible bag so it has the backpack straps in the back that are detachable not at the top but um, down here you can um, put them through the uh, hardware here and then tuck them in this back pocket right here and then you can wear it just with the shoulder strap and I do like this um, strap right here because it can get relatively short so it looks it's just like a nice little shoulder bag and it's not like too long because um, I like to just throw it over my shoulder like when I'm getting in the car so that is what it looks like and um, I have had the original version of this bag, the La Mer, and that was, um, I would say that's like my all-time favorite diaper bag. Like when I got that one, I was like, oh, okay, I, I can stop now. I don't need to keep trying all the bags, but I continue to try them anyways. But yeah, so I, I love the original size La Mer, um, especially I would recommend that one for like a new mom um, for sure. But since my kids are, my youngest is almost 18 months, so, and then I have a three-year-old and a five-year-old, so I need less um, of a bag on most days, because like Monday through Friday, I'm usually just like taking my two older kids to and from school and stuff, so I don't need a huge bag. But, um, so I'm really liking the size of this bag, and I'm gonna just kind of go over the bag and show you how I have it packed. So there aren't any feet on the bag. This is vegan leather, and I really like the quality of this bag. It feels really nice and durable. It's soft, it's thick, it feel, it just feels nice. Like I've had some vegan leather diaper bags and they just feel really cheap. This feels really nice. Um, the hardware is really nice. Um, so I will just go ahead and get into it. Here's this um, grab handle here. It is vegan leather on the top and then it has this, um, what is it, like nylon? nylon on the bottom but it feels really sturdy um, you have this nice front pocket here that's just a slip pocket there's no zipper but it does have a magnetic closure um, the magnet is not super strong in the front I'm guessing that's because the vegan leather is thick so the magnet doesn't catch as well as it could but um, yeah so it's not super strong but that's okay I have my keys in the front pocket here and then I also throw my phone in this pocket as well and then I usually never use this pocket over here but this is a nice spot like to put your small wallet or something like that these little pockets over here they are pretty tight but you can get like a, hmm, I think if you don't have anything in the inside you can get like a sippy cup on the sides but you can definitely put like I just have trash right there but you can definitely put some stuff in there um, now this is the vegan leather petite so if you're looking at the luxe petite it might be a little bit tighter I've heard that the, the luxe leather is a little bit stiffer than the vegan leather just a heads up on that so the inside is this really nice wipeable like mauve like dusty rose kind of color um, it's it's really nice so this is what it looks like on the inside and I would say that I am a minimal packer I mean, I like to be prepared, but I also don't want to carry anything more than what I would need because I, I don't want to carry a bunch of stuff around. Um, and this bag works for me. So, but it is, I mean, it is tight. Like this is all I can really fit. Well, I can fit probably like a sweatshirt or something on top, but this is all I would need and it's great. Okay. So the first pouch I have here is this Dagny Dover Scout pouch, and this is in the large size. Um, and this is in the dark moss color. And in here, it's a perfect size for diapers and clothes. I just threw my sunglasses in here because they're protected in this neoprene fabric here, but I have just like um, backup underwear, a wet bag, one pull up and one diaper. And then in the next pouch here, I have um, a snack bag and I only have a few snacks in there now and this is a dragonfly sis boutique custom pouch um, 
and I found her shop on, she's on Instagram and Etsy, I believe, but this is such a cute pattern for fall. So snacks, I have diapers and wipes, and I have my, uh, my crustable. And then this is my med kit, and I really like this. This is the, um, the Wonder Woman Jujube collaboration, but this is like a custom med kit. I didn't like this girl on Etsy just had this already made and I just bought it, but I, it's really nice quality. Um, and I love it for med kit obviously, but <laughs> cause I can see everything I need, um, or everything I have in it. So I really like that and I can link it below. Um, but I would definitely recommend one of these little pouches. And then on the side here, I have um, wipes and tissues. And then in these front two pockets, I just have um, one of the pockets. I have masks for my kids. I always have to have a ton because they wear them at school and I always have to make sure I have extras and stuff. And one for me. Um, and then over on the side, I have my wallet, and I just have a little card case that I got on Amazon. And then in the back, I have an Orchid Hearts wipes case. And then I have it pretty thin, um, so I'm trying to be really minimal in this bag. Um, and then in the back here, I just have like my mace and some random stuff for me. But I will just kind of go through the pockets a little bit better. So there's two slip pockets on the front, elasticated pockets. One's a little bit bigger than the other. And then there's two mesh pockets on the side that can definitely hold a sippy cup. My daughter's thermos container fits in those just fine. Um, and then there's this magnetic slip pocket in the back and then a zipper pocket behind that. And then I do have a large, a wall of water bottle and this is like the 24 ounce and I'll just show you how it would fit it will fit in this bag um, and you can zip that for sure if you need to carry a large water bottle for you I'm not sure if you would really want to put it on the outside but let's see Ooh, I mean it does not look very cute but it does fit in there um, so that is everything I have in my new little Azaria Petite, and I absolutely love it. Um, if you have any questions about the bag um, or anything like that, just let me know in the comments below. Oh yeah, and there is this nice slip pocket on the back, and it is not magnetic or anything like that. Um, so yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye.